Hello everyone, in this video I am going to show you what is environment that new land property in UiPath. So before going to this, look at this document and here what is array variable is an array variable is a type of variable which enables you to store multiple values of same data type. For example employee names is an array variable and it stores multiple values with the same data type. So you can't add any int or salary in this employee names. To add any int uh, ages of employees, you can uh, create a age array variable and you can store the values in the thin flower braces. Okay. So in our task, I'm going to use a environment variable dot and sorry environment dot new line property to print each and every value with a new line. Okay. So after printing this uh, value John, I will add a new line so that the Smith value will print in the next new line. Okay. So go to our task and I'm going to use an assign activity and I'm create, sorry, I will create a new variable and I will name it as employee names. Okay, and I will store the values in this within flower braces or I can simply copy the values from my document. And next we need to change its variable type to array of strings. So click on this drop down and click on this array of tt is nothing but it's a type array of types is it's a string type of array variables okay so next uh, to print this uh, um, variable we can use a write line activity and i want to print the first name in output panel so i will give uh, variable name employees name and index zero and I will convert this to, to string okay so let me run this process and uh, you can see the output so John is printed at the output and similarly if you want to print let me copy it and I will paste it and to print uh, these five names I need to use uh, five, five right line activities so let me paste so here are only six um, names so I need to use six right line activities to print uh, six names I will just change the index of this to one and two three and four so in this task i have um, created a variable name employee names and i have stored six names inside this employee names array variable and i have printed um, each name from by using this index of the value 0 1 2 3 4 5 so it will print all the six names from that employee names array so let me run this process and show you So look at this output, the six names like John Smith, Steve, Ankit, Akshay and Virat have printed at the outline output 
so no need to use this right line activity so let me show you how to print all this names without using right line activity this many times we can simply go for environment dot new line property to print the same output okay so let me show you that and i will delete all these right line activities instead of uh, using this right line activities i will simply use environment dot new line property to print the names uh, each name in new line okay so inside this right line activity i will open in advanced editor let me use a plus symbol to concatenate with a new line and i am going to use this environment dot new line property so i will concatenate with the second name employee names and i will give the index as one to print the second name from the employee names array and i will use environment dot new line property to be a line after this print after printing this name so similarly plus for printing the third name pass the variable name and give the index as a two and plus for the line environment dot new line after printing the third line i will print the fourth name employee names of index 3 and i will use the property environment dot new line so you can print up to uh, you can give up to five indexes to print all the six names but here i am going to show you how to print only for four uh, names from the array variable employee names okay so look at this uh, it will print the first name and it will give a new line and it will print the second name and it will give a new line and similarly the fourth name and it will give a new line okay so let me run this process and show you how it comes in the output panel so look at this output panel each name is printed with a new line so this is how using environment dot new line property so instead of using right line activity every time to print these names you can use only one right line activity and you can use uh, environment dot new line property to give us a line after this value okay so do practicing thanks for watching if you like this video please do like and subscribe